But you don't look anything like me. Fascinating. No, you don't look anything like me. Check in twice, that's all I'm asking. You should be precise or you'll have a disaster. See, you look like me in the mirror. No, you look like me in the mirror, moron. It's fascinating. I successfully split myself into two people, and one of them is clearly delusional. What the hell does that say about me? Look, you're short, heavy, and have a full beard. Well, you're a blonde-haired, blue-eyed, freaking giant. What? How heavy? Okay, so we do look a little different to each other. That actually makes sense. I, we, whatever, was trying to split myself into two aspects of my personality. So clearly we succeeded. Which means I'm one half and you're the other half. Well, which half am I? Well, if you're saying I look like Captain America, then you look kind of Seth Rogen-y. Are you saying I'm the negative side of our personality? Son of a bitch! That doesn't necessarily mean that you're negative. You're just... the other stuff. Screw yourself. I want the rest of me back! Hey, not before we do what we split ourselves to do in the first place. You really think you and me can come to an agreement on how to date a girl? I think we gotta at least try. Otherwise, what's the point? We put ourselves back into the same guy, he still has to go on this date, and he'll still have no idea what the hell to do. Okay. It's pretty simple, right? Our man Milton... talks smooth all night, with just enough, uh, sexual innuendo. Gets her nice and uh, lubricated, if you know what I mean. At the end of the night, bada bang! Yeah! No! Well, what would you do, Boy Scout? Shake your hand and respect your virtue? To start? I would buy her flowers, take her to a nice restaurant, enjoy a fine meal, pleasant conversation, and at the end of the night, I would take her home and ask if I could kiss her goodnight, and then bid her adieu. Wake up, Captain Virginity! This is a blind date from an internet site, AKA screwed up girls and ugly chicks. Let's get a little bang for your buck and get out! Every girl deserves to be treated with respect and dignity and treated as a prospect until she proves otherwise. And didn't you see all those eHarmony commercials? A lot of marriages are found on the internet. Marriage. Marriage? I'm trying to look out for our man Milton here. You're trying to get him to walk the plank? Besides, have you ever seen any awkward scientist types on those commercials? Milton's not the commercial guy. He's the, oh please, oh please, I hope I get laid from this guy. Well, apparently not, because I'm one half of him and I'm advocating marriage. Well, clearly, I'm the realistic half. <laughs> this is getting us nowhere. Why don't you show me what you would do on a date? So tell me about your many cats. They sound so interesting. Oh, for the love of God. What? Ah! Wow, three cats. I like a lot of pussy too. Douche. I love kids. I love a nice set of twins. <laughs> <laughs> you look lovely tonight. Wow, you are not as fat as I expected. Please, let me get the check. I'm getting in tonight, right? I mean, I want to know before I pay. Okay, clearly this isn't working, so I'm just going to go myself.
Oh no you don't! That's my future we're talking about, and I'm not gonna end up married to Ugly Fat Girl 2963 from SadSingleBastards.com! What? I'm gonna let you club her over the head and drag her back to your cave. Yes! At this rate, we're never gonna figure it out. I'm just gonna call and cancel. No, 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 you can't do that! No, oh, no has been paying for this site for three years, and this is his first day. Ah, if we don't call and cancel, we could ruin his chances forever. Let's go. Have other chances? Give me the phone. No, let's go. Stop it. Come on, Hitler, you no. Give it up. Ah. Come on, let's Stop, you bearded looking mother. Why are you like a koala bear? I don't know. Ah. <laughs> Hello, Hello, Milton, Milton speaking. speaking. Hi, Milton. Um, this is Leslie. There's a little problem with our date tonight. Uh, oh, no. Do you want to cancel? Oh, no, no, no. It's just that my cousin, she came in town unexpectedly, and I just can't leave her at my apartment all by herself. So I was wondering if maybe you have a friend that uh, could Uh, you know, I, I do have a friend. I think that might actually work out. Is she is skinny? Excuse me? Ah, that wasn't me. That was, uh... That was oh, something God. else. Oh, it's okay. it's a cheap Come and leave her at home! Oh, so, uh, I'll, I'll talk to you later. Okay. 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 Okay.